What's up everybody, I'm Pierce Simpson and you just clicked play on the newest series, Gridiron Kicks, an interactive show that takes a look at some of the top cleats worn by some of your favorite NFL players. In today's episode, we take a look at the week one matchups and some of the cleats that caught our eye on Gridiron Kicks. To begin things, we take a look at the first game of the 2014 NFL season in which defending Super Bowl champion Seattle Seahawks took on the Green Bay Packers. In a game in which the Seattle Seahawks vaunted defense dominated, we witnessed all-pro safety Earl Thomas bring out a Seahawks theme Air Jordan 6 model. However, Thomas took the world by storm as he showcased the all chrome version model of the Air Jordan 6. The Air Jordan 6 seemed to be a theme of the weekend as over eight Jordan brand players brought out their own PE versions to showcase in their week one matchups. With Air Jordan 6 as being a theme of the weekend, we ventured towards America's game of the week as the San Francisco 49ers took on the Dallas Cowboys. In a matchup that pits two Jordan brand athletes against one another, Michael Crabtree and Des Bryant showed off their illustrious Air Jordan 6 PEs. However, Michael Crabtree brought out a custom pair of PE made by Recon Beat Lab in which he made his hometown debut paying homage to the Dallas Cowboys. Incorporating a navy blue upper and white accents, Michael Crabtree turned a lot of heads as he sported these in AT&T Stadium. However, due to NFL uniform policies, Michael Crabtree is subject to a $10,500 fine for his uniform violation. Tough. However, Crabtree hopes to auction off these uh, Air Jordan 6 PEs for charity. Venturing towards Des Bryant, we saw the star wideout make his week one debut in the metallic silver and Cowboys blue Air Jordan 6 PE. Now while the Cowboys came up short, Des Bryant was still able to give star point guard and huge Dallas Cowboys fan Chris Paul his very own Air Jordan 6 PE. During last night's game, we saw Matthew Stafford and Calvin Johnson defeat the New York Giants 35 to 14, all while sporting the latest edition of the Nike CJ Elite 2D. Now keeping up with the newest NFL tradition of having two Monday night games during week one, the nightcap saw the Arizona Cardinals defeat the San Diego Chargers 18 to 17. Now what's particularly noteworthy about this game is the fact that arguably the best cornerback in the league, Patrick Peterson, made his Under Armour debut. With his Nike contract expiring this offseason, Peterson signed a lucrative deal with Under Armour hoping to become a signature athlete. As Peterson has stated, he hopes to bring custom pairs of the Under Armour deception to each game, thus showing off his personality. Last night, we saw the Under Armour Deception incorporate a gold motif along the upper, along with Arizona Cardinal red finishing throughout. If Peterson keeps this up, he makes a strong case for having some of the best customs and PEs throughout the league. With week one in the books, we look forward to another exciting NFL season. What cleats caught your eye? Was it Patrick Peterson's Under Armour debut? Or how about Michael Crabtree's customs down in Dallas? Let us know in the comment section below and head over to NiceKicks.com for further news and exclusive content. I'm your man, Pierce Simpson. Thank you for tuning in to Gridiron Kicks.